Edo indigents who are living outside Nigeria have all come to salute and thank their governor, Mr. Godwin Obaseke, for his character, integrity, and performance in office. Governor Godwin says the modular refinery in Olobo, Igboba, Oka local government area is ready for production. A father said, my people are excited that such projects will go a long way in improving the socio-economic development for our community. Also, plans to renovate public primary schools are ongoing. The news in the days. But please don't forget to give us a thumbs up and please hit the subscription button down below. I see you. As you do so, may the blessings of God never cease to overflow in your lives as you support my channel. Amen. Edo in Diaspora commend Obaseki on modular refinery project. Edo State Indigents in the Diaspora have commended Governor Godwin Obaseki on the progress of work on the 6,000 BPD Edo modular refinery noting that the project will boost industrialization in the state. Some professionals in the oil and gas industry abroad have spoke to journalists, noted that with the production slated to commence in August, Obaseki had kept his promise of delivering the project on time to engender socioeconomic development of the state a graduate of the IFP in France, Osia Polo Ariyo, said the modular refinery project would be a game changer in the country, especially as it was delivered with the active participation of the Edo state government. He noted that the project would have ripple effects on the local economic as early industries such as haulage and logistics, real estate and polyethylene, among others, will spin off from the activities of the refinery. Also, island-based Asamutsa Orere noted that the project was proof of the Obaseki administration dexterity, noting that, so, that the much anticipated industrial growth in the state was finally taking shape. Beside the Edo State Government has approved funds for the construction and renovation of more schools across the state as part of efforts to ensure a conducive learning environment for students under the Edo Basic Education Sector Transformation Program. In a statement issued the Bini City, Executive Chairperson of the Edo State Universal Basic Education Board, Dr. Juan Osa Oviewe, said the board was inviting technical bids from eligible bidders who wish to, pre who wish to be pre-qualified for the project. Works to be e executed under the project will include the construction of public primary schools, and renovation of existing public primary school structures across the state. Other aspects covered by the project are the provision of water supply and toilet facilities, as well as procurement and supply of furniture to public primary schools across the state, she said. Please leave us a comment. We would like to hear from you. Thanks for watching. Bye.